All righty. So here's part two of this movie idea. So for those who did not see part one, which is, you know, it is what it is, a little boring. <laughs> Sorry. This is more exciting. <laughs> Let me get, get down to business here. Okay. So as you can see, let's read it together, okay? Vodka. I don't even wish because vodka is tough. Okay. Can you create a story about a younger 25 old version of myself? And my name is Lamar Myers, which is, and I am... <laughs> 50 years old now, so the way the story would go is I am able to come face to face. I'm leaving that mistake in there, but okay, I'm able to come face to face with my 25 year old cocky self, and we must have a battle to see who can continue moving on with your lives without any losses and any fights. So if the 25 year old version wins, they then they will live on in their universe as, as the undefended undefeated champion and if they lose they would have one loss and that would change the course of their life in the 50 year old me if i lose i would have one loss in my life changing the fate of my future and if i win then i am undefeated until i reach 100 years old and have to face my 50 year old version of me and win and we must battle to see if that 50-year-old version will win or lose. And if the 50-year-old version wins, then they will be undefeated until they hit age 100. And then they will have to battle their 50-year-old version to see who reigns supreme. And if by some chance the 100-year-old version of me wins against the 50-year-old version, then the 100-year-old version wins $1 trillion and gets to live until 150 years old. But no one knows the prize for the battle and it's completely secretive and make the mood funny and jaw dropping like Jaws the movie. Let's see. I am nervous about this one. I'm not sure. Okay. It's going to be a tough one. Oh boy. Is creating something. <laughs> I am so nervous. Why am I nervous? Like, it's not a test. It's not like I'm gonna get fired from a job. I love what I do. Wait for it to finish. Another drink of. Thailand. All right, you ready? I'm ready. <clears throat> Lamar, okay, let's see, let's see how long this is. Woo wee! Okay, here we go. Lamar Myers, a confident and ambitious 25 year old, strutted down the street, feeling on top of the world. He had just landed his dream job and was ready to take the world by storm. Suddenly, he found himself face to face with a familiar face, but it wasn't just any face; it was his own face, but 25 years younger. Who are you, Lamar? Asked, completely bewildered. I'm you, Lamar. You're a younger, cockier self, the 25-year-old version of Lamar replied. Lamar couldn't believe what he was seeing. He had always been confident, but this was on another level. His younger self challenged him to a battle, and the stakes were high. Whoever won would be able to continue on with their life as the undefeated champion, while the other would have to accept a loss and live with it for the rest of their life. Interesting. Lamar accepted the challenge knowing that he couldn't let his younger self win. The two of them squared up, ready to fight it out and see who would come up on top. It was a fierce battle with both Lamars landing punches and dodging blows. The tension was high and the crowd gathered around them, cheering them on. In the end, it was the 50-year-old Lamar who emerged victorious, having outsmarted his younger self. The younger Lamar was was shocked and disappointed, but he knew he had to accept his loss and move on with his life. As the crowd dispersed, the older Lamar couldn't help but feel a sense of relief and accomplishment. He had defeated his younger, cockier self, and he knew that he would be able to continue on with his life as an undefeated champion. But little did he know there was a secret prize for the winner of the battle. If the 100-year-old version of Lamar could defeat his 50-year-old self, he would win a $1 trillion and get to live until the age of 150. The thought of the prize made Lamar laugh. He couldn't believe that he had just battled his younger self for, no, for nothing more than bragging rights. As he walked away, Lamar couldn't help but feel grateful for the opportunity to face his younger self. It had been a funny and jaw-dropping experience, one that 
he would never forget. And who knows, maybe he would get the chance to face his 50-year-old self in the future and winning the trillion dollar prize. So it's actually, it's pretty good. It's interesting, but they kind of missed the point about me being 50 fighting the 25-year-old. And then as the 50-year-old wins, they once they hit 100, then they have to fight the 50-year-old for it. But they kind of put it in there, but it didn't really come out quite. So I'm trying to figure out how to redo it without reading this over. So I'm just going to say it like this. <clears throat> and, and you rewrite this story and add when the 50-year-old version wins that that in another scene that 50 year old version is 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 now 100 years old and sees and see and sees his 50 year old version face to face to fight to fight again and and let the hundred year 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 old version win and give details on how the hundred hundred year version one and give details on what happened immediately after the fight and how the hundred year version received his one trillion dollars and give details on how the hundred year old version was was able to live to be a hundred and fifty with one trillion dollars. Let's see. I'm just gonna add it. <laughs> but AI is good. I mean, that's a good, good start. I would, I would most likely, if I really want to go deeper, I would have to look at every section of what it wrote. Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, oh no, I didn't. No. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, this is fun. I, I, I'm curious what it would say. You know, when you hit a hundred and okay. This is so cool. Come on, I want to see, I want to see. Let's see, it's not responding. Might be too complicated. Aha, now you got a little, little keynote there. Just hit more. Oh, I see something. Okay. All right. Let's just read this and we'll keep it like this. I don't want to keep this video long, but mostly I just want you to see the power of AI. What, what OpenAI has created is a true, unbelievable masterpiece monster. That's how I look at it. It's not a monster. It's a masterpiece monster. Because people look at monsters as negative or something. There's nothing negative about this. Lamar Myers, a confident and accomplished 50-year-old, was strolling down the street when he suddenly confronted was <laughs> uh, was suddenly confronted by a familiar face. It was a younger, cocky version of himself. Trying, okay, Lamar's younger self challenged him to a battle with the winner being able to continue with their life as an undefeated champion. Lamar accepted knowing that he couldn't let his younger self win. The battle was intense with both Lamars exchanging blows and trying to outmaneuver each other. In the end, it was the 50-year-old Lamar who emerged victorious. Years passed and Lamar reached the age of 100. 
He had lived a full life, but couldn't help but wonder if he would ever get a chance to face his video self again. One day, Lamar found himself face to face with his video self once again. This time, the stakes were even higher. If the 100-year-old Lamar won, he would receive $1 trillion and be able to live until the age of 150. The battle was fierce, but both Lamar using all their skills and experience to try to gain the upper hand. But in the end, it was the 100-year-old Lamar who emerged victorious. As the crowd cheered, Lamar couldn't believe what just happened. He had won $1 trillion and would be able to live for another 50 years. He felt a surge of excitement, hell yeah, in anticipation of all possibilities that lay ahead. But even more than that, he felt a sense of pride and accomplishment. He had faced his younger, cockier self twice and had emerged victorious both times. He knew that he had lived his life to the fullest and had achieved everything he had ever wanted. As he walked away from the battle, Lamar felt a sense of satisfaction and contentment. He knew that he had won the ultimate prize, not just the money, but the, not, the knowledge that he had lived his life to the fullest and had achieved everything he had ever wanted with his $1 trillion, he could continue to live his life to the fullest, pursuing his passion and enjoying every moment. In the days following, ho, 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 ho. In the, days following the battle, Lamar was inundated with requests for interviews, appearances, and endorsements. <laughs> Everyone wanted a piece of the man who had won $1 trillion and had lived to be one fifty. Lamar was happy to oblige, knowing that he had a unique opportunity to share his story and inspire others to pursue their dreams. He traveled the world, giving speeches and meetings with people from all walks of life. He donated millions of dollars to charity, knowing that he had the power to make a real difference in the world. Yeah. As the years passed, Lamar continued to live his life to the fullest. He pursued his passion, travel, traveled to exotic locations, and enjoyed every moment of his long and fulfilling life. And when he finally reached age of 50, Lamar knew that he had lived a truly remarkable life. He had achieved everything he had ever wanted and more he had won the ultimate prize not just the money but the knowledge that he had lived his life to the fullest and inspired others to do so as he closed his eyes for the final time lamar knew that he had left a lasting legacy he had shown the world what was possible Never saw that before as he closed his eyes for the final time. Whoa. That made me tear up again. <laughs> he had shown the world that what was possible when he dared to dream big and pursued your passions with all your heart. For that, he would always be remembered as a true champion. Stories do tug at the heart, man. That was that was incredible. I'm crying, man. I just can't. As he closed his eyes for the final time, that hit me hard. Like, did I just? That means I'm going to die when I'm 150. That's 100 years from now. <clears throat> thank you. Thank you, chat GPT. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry. That was, that was really, 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 really powerful. That's a freaking movie. I mean, I can totally, and I won't, but I can totally go, can you create a script from all this? A two-hour movie script. And it was just... Sam Altman, you and your team did it, man. This is amazing. Thank you. I'm going to get out of this unbelievable the power of ai joke jokes <laughs> the folks it's oh my god as he closed his eyes for the final time i was just like oh, did i just call my own demise i know some people probably look at that as whatever but it's just a story folks it's a fucking good story. Sam, I believe it's Sam Altman. I should know your name. As Sam, uh, um, I hope you I hope someday you look at this because I'm pretty sure you guys know all this, but my God, the power of AI is fucking insane. It's beautiful. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> As he closed his eyes for the final time, Lamar knew that he had left a lasting legacy. All right. All right. I got to go. That's crazy. That's unbelievable. 
that's real emotion. Oh, I can't even see. <laughs> oh. Thank you, OpenAI, ChatGPT, Sam, Sam Hoffman and team for creating something. This literally changed my life for the past seven, eight months. Or whenever you released it. I, I want to say that. I just one was in November. <laughs> I just remember really using it for the past, definitely past six months. Definitely. All right. Mm, mm. Nose running. <laughs> Tissue. So obviously I've been crying before. It's the power of AI. Ah, you guys try it, man. Just be yourself and just be long-winded, like I said. Wow. 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 And as he closed his eyes for the final time, Lamar knew he had left a long last in vacancy. This is my life, man. This is my life. Okay. 